Welcome to Mastering Solutions. In this problem, they want us to look at A, B, and C and determine what the sign is, if it's positive or negative for both the position and the velocity. So for part A, the position will be X, and the velocity, of course, is V. And so right here is zero, and we are to the negative side of the X axis, and all of these, all of the dots are on that side. So all of them will have a negative position. Now the arrows are indicating the velocity and they're moving towards the positive x direction. So since they're going towards the positive, the velocity will be a positive v for part a. Now going to part b, the position y will be the same thing. It's all below the zero, so it's all on the negative side of the y axis. So all of these will have a negative position. The velocity for this is all going down towards the negative y-axis, so it will still have a negative velocity and the negative position. Lastly, for part C, we'll have the position as y, and these ones are all above the zero, so they're all on the positive side of the y-axis. So all of these will have a positive position. And then the velocity, v, are all going towards the negative side of the y-axis. So, so just like on part b, we'll have a negative velocity for part c.